vlogged at all yet today because I've just kind of been at home doing nothing. It's like the first like actual day I feel like I've had off. Um, but yeah, I'm at Kane's right now with my roomie. This is David. Yeah, so we're at Kane's right now. We're gonna have some food and then later on I'm going to the movies with Taylor. So that's gonna be a lot of fun. And so yeah, I will catch you guys in a bit. Kids. Woo! Hey Hallie Cats, so we're back with the vlog Miss Day 9. Um, uh, you just saw us at Kane's and we decided to do a little bit of a roommate tag because um, he just moved in literally yesterday. Yep. So we're going to do a roommate tag with him just now being my roommate and then before he moves out because he's only going to be living with us until May. Yep, that's when I graduate. Yes. So, because he's only going to be living with us till May, we'll do another one in May, um, like right before he moves out, and we'll see how if the answers change um, or whatnot. And so, yeah. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Cool. I'm excited. All right. So, did you know each other before com um, becoming roommates? Yes. yes. We did. Yes, we did. We've gone to multiple concerts together, too. We went to, what, three concerts before? Yeah, yeah. Actually room together. Cold War Kids, Kim Petras, AJR. 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 Um, what were your first impressions of each other? <laughs> Do you want to go first? Um, okay, so I think my first time actually, like, really talking to you is when you came in the station, but I knew you were Tanner's friend. So, like, I was like, oh, he seems like a cool guy, and Tanner said, like, multiple good things about you because yeah. you guys work together. Um, and so I was like, alright, and then we bonded over AJR, like, the first night, and we're like, let's go to a yeah. concert together, and then we're like, cool, and then we planned for it later on, and... I don't know, so you just seemed like a cool, like, fun guy to hang out with right off the bat. <laughs> yeah, i say probably, like, the experience was just about the same. Uh-huh. I'm a senior in college, so, like, I'm just like, oh, it's a cute little, <laughs> cute little underclassman. Yep, second year here. My god. How long did it take for you guys to become friends? Were you friends before becoming roommates? Yes, we were obviously friends before becoming roommates. I think we kind of hit it off right off the bat. Yeah, I think it was just pretty quick, you know? Yeah. Once you bond over music at AJR, it's kind of... It's inevitable. Bond <laughs> Yeah. Well, and then, like, when we did, because um, I didn't really talk to him over the summer, but when we yeah. came back and went to the AJR concert and everything, I actually rode with him, um, and we snapped it a couple times before that, but, like, we stayed after, us two stayed after, the other two yeah. went home, but we stayed after and met Tessa Violet and everything, and she's fucking amazing. Yeah. Oh, my God, I love Tessa Violet. And we started our post-concert Raising Cane's tradition. Yeah, we didn't go to a concert tonight, but we did go to Cane's tonight, so. Yeah. so Never yeah. a wrong time for Cane's. <laughs> uh, what do you most commonly argue about? Have we argued about anything yet? I don't think like a proper argument, but like we both yell about random things. We just randomly look at each other and we're like, put him up! Yeah. Fight me! It's been like three times today we've, we've fought, <laughs> yeah. so. But only like that though, like nothing legitimate. Yeah, not yet. Not not yet. Uh, what thing does your roommate do the most that bothers you? <laughs> I don't know if I have anything to say right now, considering it's only been. It's about literally been like twenty four hours. hours. <laughs> but. Ask me again in six months and we'll see yeah. where that answer is. I was going to say, I don't think that anything that you do like really bothers me yet. Like You play music, but like we have similar music tastes yeah. for the most part. Um, and, and if I need to, I'll just put on my headphones. Yeah. And, like, and like I've been cognizant about like using like my own earphones when yeah. like, we're both doing different things. So Yeah, it's not a big deal. Although, it's funny, he woke up this morning and he like Snapchatted me for streaks. And then I didn't Snapchat him back right away. And he goes... <laughs> Snapchat me, ho! <laughs> like, maybe that'll be an issue. <laughs> Not really. Um, what do you think of your roommate's YouTube channel? I have not seen an episode <laughs> or anything. He has not watched not a watched single it. one of my nope. videos. That's so funny. I see all the posts about it, so... Mm -hmm. I mean, I can have that much. Uh, I guess, do you think it's cool that I do YouTube? Yeah, I mean, my girlfriend does has a book tube, so okay. and I've been on that a couple times. Yeah. I was gonna say I like I feel like a lot of our friend group does a lot of different things and like we do engage in a lot of it. I do actually like because Chris and Tanner have a podcast together and um I'm like the social media rep for it as well as like the part time editor for it as well. And I do listen to all the episodes but also like you do graphic design stuff. Yeah. 
Um, and then Anthony also does a YouTube, and I haven't seen, like, I've seen half of his first video, and I haven't seen the second video yet. But we all just kind of do things, yeah. but we're all friends outside of the things that we do, so we just appreciate each other as friends, I think, mostly. Yeah, like, like, she said that exactly, like, about two minutes before we started doing this video, like, I do photography and graphic design, and mm -hmm. right now I'm working on an animation project for this class, so I do a lot of that stuff. Just a very talented friend group. Because then also our friend Taylor is a dancer, and she dances True. with the dance team and all that too, so... True. Talents all around. Very artistic much. <laughs> Who spends the longest time getting ready in the morning? Our roommate, Anthony. <laughs> Seriously! <laughs> he spent like an hour in the fucking bathroom! Oh my god! Oh, yes. Yep. Yeah. Let's see, I took like, what, seven minutes to get ready this morning? Yeah, and then I just like brush my teeth and use the brushing yeah. so like it wasn't that much we too. both i think take around the same time yeah I'm how long quick. are your showers normally it depends if i've had a long day i will just let the hot water rain down on me but normally i take pretty quick showers yeah i take like five to ten minute showers um unless i'm washing my hair and then it's like 15 maybe 20 minutes um, just because my hair is a process. I have two different shampoos and two different conditioners I have to use. And then after I get out of the shower, I have to put like this coconut milk in it that's color protecting and a coconut oil in it. It's a process. Um, that's how I keep it so blue. <laughs> I also have some pretty bitch in here too, if I, don't, if I do say so myself. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what is something you didn't notice about each other before until you became roommates? Is there anything yet that we've noticed that we haven't noticed before? I don't know. Then again, it's only been 24 hours. Yeah. I was going to say, um, I don't know. I know how you decorate now. True. <laughs> well, I mean, I don't have that much decoration. Yeah, I know. But like, right I know, now, so. I know the simplicity of your decorations and I know like your style a little bit more, I guess. I know that you own more than just the Converse shirt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Every time we hang out and go to a concert, it's always the Converse shirt. Yeah. Her <laughs> side of the room is out there and I just have four pictures on the wall and some fairy, fairy lights, lights right now. I have like one, two, two sets of fairy lights and then the big lights which are like yours, like Christmas lights. And then I got posters and stuff. You guys have seen the room before. Yeah, if have, not, it's linked below. I have my photography on the wall right now and I'm pretty sure it's gonna keep on growing like that but probably oh, some yeah. of my photography and graphic design work and stuff. So. We also have a sketch from that he did in my oh, sketchbook yeah. hanging up <laughs> in the middle of the room and we decide yeah. we're gonna expand on that too. Well, one wall that's Mine, one wall that's hers, and then one wall that's both, both of ours. <laughs> and then I'm going to decorate my closet soon because why not? I don't have a closet. <laughs> Do you ever get tired of seeing each other? It's been 24 hours. I'm already tired. <laughs> I'm so tired. So tired. He's like, I want to move out. <laughs> I wanted to move out before I moved in. I'm so tired. He, he constantly like threatened it all the time. He's like, God damn it, because we went to watch Frozen 2 together. Oh. You ruined Frozen 2, and you all know that. Yeah, and if not, it'll also be linked down below. I apparently, I'm linking two Vlogmas days already down below. I still below. haven't seen it, so I can't give my review. Sorry. Um, how do you avoid tension while living together? Do your own thing? Lots of drugs. <laughs> lots and lots of drugs. Yeah? Lots and lots of drugs. Disclaimer, he is 21, the by drugs. the way, just so you know. Why'd you have to tell them that? I want them to know as little about me as possible. <laughs> okay, there's the tension right now. There it is. You see it. I have a bottle of Jack Daniels in the fridge right now that I'm just going to go ham on once this video ends. Apparently. <laughs> I'm responsible, though. Uh, do you have a roommate agreement or a set of rules? We have a verbal agreement. Not yeah. to be a dick. Yeah, pretty much. Well, and like, we haven't talked to you officially about like our rules of just like... Oh, it's just common courtesy stuff. Like, make sure you ask before you bring people over. Yeah. Like, ask everyone. Um, just kind of, like, keep in mind of everyone getting ready in the morning when it comes to bathroom usage. Yeah. Just, like, little yeah, things like that. And then as far as, like, the chores go, like, we ha do a chores that we switch once a week. We have not introduced you to that yet. And as long as you kind of keep on top of that, like, and keep so we can all pitch in to keep our apartment clean. And as long as you do your own dishes, we're chill. Just I'm fine with do that. your shit and leave us alone, you know? <laughs> Don't be a dick. <laughs> Do you share a bathroom and how do you deal with that? Well, I mean, all four of us in this apartment share the bathroom, so... Mm -hmm. It is a double vanity, but it's one one toilet and one shower, so... Yeah, so... It's interesting. Some mornings I yell at Anthony a lot. <laughs> <laughs> like this morning! Oh, God! She just went off on Anthony. 
<laughs> it's because his parents were coming over yeah. and anytime anyone comes over especially people who I don't know that well like I hate when people see me not ready which is why you guys haven't seen me like before I've gotten ready in the morning yet I like hate it I can't handle it like this morning was probably the first time you've ever seen me before like I've actually been ready for a day like even my closer friends like they have not seen that as much it's really hard for me to do that for brunch I never come in PJs I'm always fully dressed like it's insane um so like I have an issue with that and Anthony was taking so long in the bathroom he took like a half an hour shower and was in there forever afterwards and then I went to go do something real quick to clean up and I had to do like some dishes or something and then I went to go get ready and he was back in there brushing his teeth and might I add he takes like 10 minutes to brush his teeth and then on top of that he was like well I gotta do my eyebrows and stuff too I was like take it out there so I could take a five minute shower. It was insane. Well, I just woke up looking this awesome. So. <laughs> Apparently. I don't All right, to try cool. It. Um, so yeah, it's like, for the most part, we're fine because we have different schedules as far as class schedules and yeah. stuff. I don't know as much with you now. Uh, it's normally like just when there's things going on on the weekend and we all happen to be getting ready at the same yeah. time that there's like ever like a, okay, who's taking the shower first? Rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> You'll introduce to it more. Yeah. yeah. Um, have your roommate's friends become your friends? I mean, I did invite her to one of my friend's uh, 21st birthday parties where we murdered him. Um, he, yeah. he died that night. Yeah. Rest in peace to Josh. But she met two of my bestest friends from high school. Yeah. And then a couple other ones. So she's met a couple of my friends. The other roommates haven't yet, but I mean, my other friends want to come to the apartment to check it out. So, because I'm the first one to move out out of all our friends even though they've been talking about it for years now i did it first so <laughs> coolio well and then um as far as the college friends we're in the same kind of friend group like oh, yeah. i like i hang out with karina and like talk yeah. to karina and then like also we all go to concerts together in this friend group so like we invite our friends to come live with us as roommates <laughs> we all hang out together we're all exactly cool. we're, we're all we have a chill. big group chat yeah where we all send each other memes from Ru like three feet apart yep uh let's see it's called trees with lights right now and then we have uh, an apartment only one called Gangs of Parrots. Yes, Gang of Parrots. Gang of Parrots. Yep. Birds aren't real. They're a government conspiracy. <laughs> Everyone knows this. Um, do you do you use your roommate things without roommates things without asking? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. What does it use no. when I wasn't around? <laughs> I'm kidding. No. No. Yeah. Nah. I was gonna nah. say common courtesy. No. Don't be a dick. Um, what are your favorite things to do with each other? Concerts. And canes. Canes. Jamming out to music. Target runs. Target run and done. Yeah. We're very chill. Yeah. <laughs> do you cook together or separately? I don't cook. At all. Cereal. And bagels. <laughs> And cold cut sandwiches are my go-to. Yeah, we all like buy our own food and kind of make our own food, but yeah, every once in a while, like every Sunday, he hasn't experienced this yet. But every Sunday, we do go to each other's apartments because they're like the friend group. There's two apartments, so we'll go to each other's for Sunday brunch. We're not doing it this Sunday just because of finals week next week, but we are going to. Um, so yeah, we didn't do it today, but tomorrow is Monday. It's reading day, and they do the midnight breakfast at the school. So we're yep. going to that together. Yes, we are. Yeah, and we eat out sometimes together. Yeah. But yeah, just do our own thing. Tanner tends to just have Taylor make him food at her apartment. <laughs> That's easy for him. <laughs> um, let's see. And Anthony always eats at McDonald's, I feel like, this week. <laughs> Hi, Tanner! I can cut it out if you really need me to. I cook sometimes. <laughs> yeah. I said sometimes you go to Taylor's apartment and she cooks you food. I didn't say all the time. Tanner says he cooks sometimes. Um, he made a nice, lovely roast while we were in San Diego. Yes, I did. It tasted great. All yeah, time exactly. <laughs> you bitch. Cut that out. Okay. We're not cutting that out. What is the best memory you have with your roommate? I say definitely the AJR concert so far. Yeah. That concert was probably, honestly, one of the best concerts I've been to. And I say 30 Seconds to Mars, up until that point, probably had the best concert I've ever been to. And I've seen them three times now. But AJR's concert was just, like, so interactive and, like, a lot of fun, a lot of high energy. And 
it was like that way throughout the entire time. So I say the con the AGR concert is probably my favorite memory so far. I think that's mine too because like also we were with uh, Chris and Taylor. And it was a lot of fun, and we all really love AJR, True. and we all had a lot of fun, and AJR knows how to put on a really good show, and the Neo Theater Tour is just amazing. Yep. It's just amazing. Like, we're, like, planning on seeing them again for the Part 2 tour this summer and taking a road trip down to San Diego, because why not? I already got <laughs> my tickets, and I know my girlfriend's not going to watch this video, so <laughs> I already have tickets for June 11th, San Diego. It is exactly my girlfriend's birthday. Mm -hmm. She's from San Diego, and she wasn't able to see them when they were in Dallas, and she won't even let me talk about it with her, and she doesn't know I got the tickets, so she is going to be so surprised when I tell her what we're doing on her birthday. That's awesome. So surprised. <laughs> um, has being roommates affected your relationship? I hate her. <laughs> I am too. I never liked her. I don't even know why I moved in. <laughs> Seriously. I like Tanner. <laughs> No, I think we have fun, although you beat me so many times in Super oh, yeah. Smash Bros now, I'm like, fuck, we gotta kick him out, he's better than I am. I main Kirby, that should say a lot. Yeah. Yeah, and when it's not Kirby, it's Lucario, or it's Ness, or it's Toon Link. Toon Link was actually a lot of fun to play as. I don't play Smash that much, but since I live here now mm -hmm. with Tanner, I feel like I'm gonna get very good. Yeah, and Anthony. Anthony plays a lot more than Tanner just because he has more time to do so. Um, but yeah. <laughs> no, I think we're fine. Uh, like I said, though, it's only been 24 hours. Check back in three months and we'll see uh, what'll happen. Um, so yeah, that's the roommate tag portion of Vlogmas Day 9. You'll still see I'm going to the movies with Taylor in a little bit. In about like 20 minutes or so, we're going to go watch Knives Out. It's going to be a lot of fun. Have another goals night. Um, so yeah, that's for now. Thank you for joining me for the roommate tag. I mean, I live here now, so... <laughs> He's like, I've accepted I'm gonna be in the vlogs and the YouTube and... Gonna be seeing a lot of such. Things. Yes. Alright. You can blur my face out, right? <laughs> yeah? I could if I wanted to. Do you want me to do this for this entire freaking roommate tag? Yeah. <laughs> Bye! We'll see you later. <laughs> with Taylor. We're gonna watch Knives Out with our free movies. Yeah. Woo. Concession time. Popcorn. <laughs> this is what happens when we're the only ones in the theater. Pet, pet the doggo. That sounds good. Pretty cool, huh? They're speaking to mom in Japanese and mom hears in English. <laughs> really dark we went and got donuts and finished the movie yes you can't see but i'm currently holding a donut uh, it was a really good movie i do fully recommend <laughs> go see knives out go st Holy yes crap. if it's... you are any kind of like mystery murder kind of person or if you love books like i do like agatha christie yeah. you will love this movie Plus, it's so good who doesn't love chris evans it's just so. so yeah i know and he's a great character in this movie and oh god yes he's my husband anyway <laughs> It's a great movie. Go watch it. And that's the end of Vlogmas Day 9. nine. So, woo! Woo! Let's woo! Go. We're going strong so far. Yeah. I made it over a week. Yay! Now for the rest of the month. <laughs> woo! Okay. All right. Good night, Hallie Cats. Good night, Hallie Cats. <laughs>